two games that's going on. Um, here to check back on another game. <clears throat> Checking out a new game. Uh, in Fear I Trust is the name of this one. Um, picked this one up in the uh, App Store uh, when it was on sale for about 10 cents, so why not try it? Um, it has about 10,000 downloads, and the rating for it is actually really good. Um, out of a 5, I think it was like a 3.8, so um, why not give it a shot? Um, anyways, uh, let's um, hit the play button and see what happens. I've got the um, remote here, so let's see if there's any support for it. doesn't seem to be any support for it <clears throat> so we'll just uh, move on so I just loaded up a few minutes to go see to see what it was like make sure it was running um, haven't actually had a chance to play it yet, so we're going to go ahead and give it a chance. And I'm using the remote right now, the joy, the, the USB pad, to see if there's any... Okay, there's no movement other than what appears to be maybe a camera up and down view, and, I don't know, maybe a jump button. Interesting. Okay, so we'll just move on to touch controls on the screen. Let's uh, see if this. There we go. All right. So the interaction is just touch screen. You just touch to interact with the things, the items on screen. Um, the graphics are pretty good. Uh, gameplay seems pretty smooth. Swipe down to put away. Swipe up to pull out your journal. Tap the cell door. So here's our first puzzle. We'll take our wrench right here. Okay. Controls can be changed anytime in the settings from the top menu. That? I'm just looking around here, taking a look and see if we find anything. Game control seems seems pretty fluid, although seems like some lag just a little bit. So we picked up something off the um, the table here. Tap the photo and see what we got. So here's a conversation between uh, two fellows, I guess. Let's see. I'm gonna swipe it on the page. was my fault. I accidentally hit the back button there. My bad, my bad. Okay. So another 
rather strange rattling conversation between two people. Picked up a key for something. Give it a little inspection here, a little. Let's see if I can adjust the controls here because <clears throat> I'm going to turn off fixed and um, see if we get what our joystick size is like now. not liking these uh, small ones. I'm not liking the fixed joysticks. Trying to fix them back in the safe room. Okay, so I'm just getting busy going in circles here. That's what is going on. I was going the wrong way. <clears throat> See how there's no other cells open. You know, assumes for down here. And this is why we do this, because, you know, you get a chance to see how complicated this is before we even get to it. Allowing me to look like 
the clueless guy who has no idea what's going on. here. Let's take a look at this puzzle. wonder what that was. So, definitely <clears throat> a lot of details in this game. Interesting little turn of events there if you read that note. I'll let you figure that out. Double swipe two fingers down to make things disappear. So I'm puzzle there. This one was uh, In Fear I Trust and uh, available on the um, App Store, um, made by Chilingo. The only thing I could ask for, honestly, is some gamepad support. Other than that, it, it seems like a really fun game. I'll see if I can open this.
Well, that was fun. So, we figured that part out. But, um, yeah, I'm going to let you, let you get to it. I'm going to go through this game. Um, we'll see what happens. So I use this um, vision thing, and you can turn it on and off. Um, and I'm not quite sure how you know how effective it is, but you see, I, I brought something up there, and um, I'm curious, honestly. Oh, maybe it's a uh, well, so. There you, that, that's part of it. You got puzzles. You got puzzles. Um, and... The puzzles help you figure out what you're looking for. There we go. So... We're going to leave it there. We're moving on, moving on to the next area, but... This just kind of gave you a chance to play. Um, the area looks fun. The area... The game is good play. Storyline is good. Graphics are good. I think it's great. And you should definitely check it out. Till next time, take it easy.